It's good to be in front of the Environment, Energy, and National Resources Committee this morning, for my bill is all about these issues, particularly about natural resources, specifically what economists and others call the ultimate resource. No, I'm not talking about oil or wind or water, as important as these are. I'm speaking specifically um, about the well-being of the ultimate resource on this planet, and that would be human beings, people, and how we live and how this bill will liberate and empower them with the robust and re reliable supplies, what we call the master resource, that would be affordable and abundant electrical energy so that we can live our lives healthy, prosperous, and free. House File 72 proposes to repeal a section of law that passed this body in 2007, uh, Senate File 145, also known as the Next Generation Act. Uh, this bill would lift what I believe to be an ill-advised moratorium that prevents Minnesota utilities from importing electrical energy from outside of this state if that power was generated by coal. Even worse, it prohibits any Minnesota company from building a new baseload facility in this state if it's fueled by coal, no matter how clean the technology be for using that uh, source. Yes, you heard it correctly. There will be no industrial tax base expanding in this state, no new high paying jobs if they're connected to a new power plant that is fueled by America's most abundant resource, fuel. This would go to exactly the ultimate resource, which would be our human beings. 